It's here, the Microsoft Lumia 640. So this is the brand new Microsoft Lumia 640 that was announced at Mobile World Congress in March. Hardware-wise, this is actually pretty close to something like the Lumia 830 with a Snapdragon 400 CPU inside, a gigabyte of RAM, uh, eight gigabytes of internal storage beneath a 720p five inch display. Beneath the removable back cover, we have space for a micro SD card slot, and we also have a removable 2500 milliamp hour battery. So we've got reasonably good hopes for some good battery life. Moving on briefly to the software, and it's pretty much as we would expect. The Lumia 640, as with the XL, comes with the latest Lumia denim firmware, although this time around we're actually looking at Windows Phone 8.1 Update 2. We haven't seen this on any other phones yet, and along with the various under the hood improvements, it comes with a few front facing visual tweaks we can see, such as a redesigned settings menu, and we also have a refreshed way to manage app permissions. The 8 megapixel rear camera may be missing Zeiss lens or pure view, but it does have an LED flash, and the 640 does also have Lumia Camera 5, complete with things like rich capture. This is, of course, something we haven't yet seen outside of Microsoft's highest end Lumia camera phones and it seems to do a pretty decent job. We'll have to test it out a little bit more thoroughly, but so far we're reasonably impressed with the quality of the pictures that the 640 is taking. If we compare briefly to the Lumia 830 for size, we'll see it's about the same, a little bit larger, and of course with the glossy finish. And if we put it next to its predecessor, the Lumia 635, we can see the iteration on the design language from last year's phone. And not forgetting, of course, you can claim a free year of Office 365 with a Lumia 640. There's a lot to like about the Lumia 640. Microsoft has a real potential gem in the mid-range on its hands here with a good quality display, nice hardware, and a relatively good price point. We'll have much more on the Lumia 640 in the days to come, including our full review. Thanks for watching.